Rona Zoro vs Shiryu, the Blind Swordsman Hi everyone, Flying Panda, Shiryu is now a Devil Fruit user with the Clear Devil Fruit. Shiryu has eaten the Tsukisuki no Mi, a Paramecia class Devil Fruit which gives him the ability to turn himself and other things invisible. With his fruit, he's able to cut opponents without being spotted, taking them by surprise. I was wrong about him having the Diamond Devil Fruit. This fruit would have made the fight different when he faced up to Zoro. Zoro had to cut Diamond to win this fight, but instead Zoro now needs to enhance his observational haki to the point where he can pinpoint where Shiryu would appear. Would that be more exciting trying to cut him like how Zoro was fighting with Mr. One, Daz Bones? Shiryu has proven to have exceptional capabilities in stealth when he plans to defect to the Blackbeard Pirates. Shiryu would infiltrate Impel Down monitor room completely undetected where he sneaked past the extremely high security of Impel Down and destroyed all the communication devices. He even snuck up to a security guard who was reporting to Magellan and killed him without being noticed. After eating the Tsukisuki no Mi, his stealth proneness increased, enabling him to perform several sneak attacks on Gekko Moria and his zombies without being noticed. With this fruit, he can make the Blackbeard Pirates appear anywhere by making them invisible. Imagine Sanjay and Wolf appearing out of nowhere on the battlefield. The question is, would Zoro have to open his left eye to see Shiryu, or worse, to force himself to see Shiryu by making himself blind? The reason he would do this is because he would then push his senses and his haki to force the situation. For example, Fujitora has an X-shaped scar centered on the left side of his forehead that stretches over both his eyes which was actually self-inflicted to this decision to blind himself. Despite being blind, Fujitora has proven to be able to handle himself extremely well in battle as he was still able to perfectly time his defense against the meteor he summoned and defected it without a problem. Talking of this purple tiger, what about a purple dragon story? A good example of this is from another series I enjoy called Saint Seiya. A character called Dragon Shiryu, his Japanese name literally means Purple Dragon, also known as Shiryu, is a bronze saint of dragon. He is considered the most mature of the five heroes and thus the wisest. Shiryu is forced to blind himself to achieve victory against Pegasus Algo. His injury does not keep him from battle. He joins his fellow bronze saints as they go to sanctuary to overthrow the false pope. Gemini Saga. He recovers his sight upon awakening his seventh sense in the fight against Cancer Death Mask. Would Zoro do the same and get his sight back? I personally don't want to see this. I'd rather he fight Shiryu without any sort of disability. Shiryu with his new powers versus Zoro would still be exciting to see. The other scenario would be that Sanji would face off against Shiryu. The reason for this is because Sanji really wanted the clear fruit. Sanji claimed that he wanted to eat the Suki Suki no because he wanted to be a superhero. Though in reality, he just wanted to peek at women while they are bathing. Sanji hated Absalom even more because he ate the Suki Suki no Mi. However, this was the only devil fruit that Sanji was ever interested in. He lost interest in the fruit after the fight with Absalom, deciding that he shall just have to peek on women anyway without it. I can't see Sanji vs Shoryu happening, but if it was to happen, I wouldn't be too shocked. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. Zoro vs Shoryu. Are you excited? Please leave a comment down below. Please click like and if you haven't, please subscribe to Flying Panda and join our Discord. <laughs> Hello? What? Panda has 50k subs? Oh, I have to tell somebody about that.